the LG V20 is here and today I'm doing a video on the Motorola Razr. So Motorola has officially announced the affordable Razr phone. So this is what the new Razr looks like. This is an affordable phone. So this is really cool. Um, so I'm on Motorola's website and and um and you guys can check this out for yourself if you guys are interested. So there's the phone right there. Um, nice looking phone. It reminds me of the Razr, of course, from from like 14, 15 years ago. So it brings like some nostalgia to it there. So um yeah. So let's go check out this new Razr. Right? So un um unstackable, unexpected, unparalleled. All right. Since the pocket ready size of a flip phone fused with the intelligence of a modern smartphone, the new radically different razor is here. Okay. Um, so yeah. What's the hype? It uh it reminds me it oh, what's the hype is that uh it um it's the same it, it looks like it looks like the original razor that yeah I see the original razor right there. It's thin, it looks similar, but it's all strained to some around obviously. Razor reinvented how many prototypes did it take to land on perfection? What's how we flip the rules again. Um, y'all, y'all guys, check out that video. A design that shatters the status quo. There's the um folding mechanism there. It says razor fits comfortably in your palm or pocket when shut, and flips open to reveal an immersive full length touch screen the new razor is a slick modern smartphone unlike any other alright so that's what the uh, phone looks like open and closed um it, like I said it reminds me of the original razor of course from a long time ago so it will for, it, if you guys had the razor from back in the day y'all you guys will feel right at home with this one uh, complexity simplified razor transform and industry challenge into an engineering breakthrough. The zero gap hands allows razor to close with both sides perfectly flushed a cohesive design that also protects the main display. So that's really cool. Says effortlessly in the now. Uh, it does have a um, external display on front. It does, it's a touch screen on front as well. So you guys can access your notifications and stuff like that. Make calls and stuff like that when the phone is closed if you guys need to. Um, the touch enable quick view display allows you to see, respond, and move on. Play your music, take selfies, see the, the notifications and more, all without ever opening your phone. So you can do a lot from that small screen there on the front of the phone when the phone is closed. So that's what the phone looks like open and closed right there. There's the uh, affordable screen there and that's what it looks like when it's closed. Two screens on the phone. Two, the two displays are made to work together. Wherever you see on quick display magically moves to the larger flex view display the moment you flip open. So that's pretty cool. So whatever is on the little uh, quick view display will um, be on the uh, main display. Be on the main display when you open it. Cinematic viewing. So that's the phone right there. It does have a little knot. It does have a knot on this phone, of course. So, uh, yeah, it says movies and videos come to life in high def on Razer's stunning, flexible display featuring cinema vision, bringing you the same ultra wide dimensions used by the film industry. So there you go. That's kind of interesting view right there. Um, 
you know, it's a nice fan, like I said, it reminds me of the original Razor from back in the day, so, yeah. Photograph phenomenal, from photograph phenomenally. Great photography. Tells the story more adultly. Capture amazing photos you'll be proud to share. Features like night vision and built in AI makes it easy to get shots you love. And like I said, you can take selfies with the display close, so y'all guys can use that little display to take selfies and stuff. So that, that is really cool. Point pose striking perfection. So it has this has has become bolder, use color in a total to totally unique way with spot color mode. Pick one color to keep and then turn everything else to and turn everything else in the photo to black and white. So that's pretty cool. The time what cameras let us capture the night use night vision mode to bring details out of the dark by combining night combining by combining eight frames of different exposures razor takes bright vivid photos with rich clarity and more accurate colors flip the rules break the boundaries of photos and video with cinemagraph mode keep a portion of your shot in motion while freezing everything else breathtaking portraits create gorgeous professional looking close-ups of portrait mode by adding an artistic blur effect in the background so that is there as well Built in smart professional results there. So that's with, um, that's, I guess that's regular, and this is with portrait mode here, so it's pretty cool. It says here, take a perfect group shot without touching the shutter button. Auto smile capture uses AI to analyze faces automatically. Snaps a photo when everyone in the frame is smiling. Snap smarter pictures by scene by scene with shot optimization. AI identifies the senior look, senior shooting, then recommends settings so you always get the perfect photo. So this camera has a lot of features and has it has a lot of AI. Uh, tools in this thing, so that's pretty cool. Um, go back here and just plug in there. So it says here, reach your full potential with smart composition based on guidelines used by professionals. It automatically generates a second optional image for you, so it takes two images there. Uh, one looks like it's like a little bit darker than the other. Power into tomorrow. Says with a battery that lasts all day, you won't have to worry about plugging in before bed. When you do need to recharge, Turbo Power gives you hours of power in just minutes. So this is a Turbo Power charging device. That's really cool. The battery's not that big. It's like what 2,700 million battery in this one. Uh, you have elevated audio. It says premium headphones tuned by expert sound engineers. Plug in the Razer earbuds and immerse yourself in your own private concert no matter where you are. So it doesn't look like it has a headphone jack so you'll get these Razer buds here which is pretty nice I guess you know. I'm not a fan of in the ear earbuds. I'm not a fan of those. I like um I like headphones the ones that go over your head. I like those. I don't like the one that goes in your ears. I don't like those. Specifications processor um, 
Inside Razor is loaded with a powerful efficient technology. The call comes from the 710 processor is designed to handle everything you need. Never worry about running out of room either. With 128 GB of storage, you can you have plenty of space for apps, photos, songs, movies, and more. Uh, that's all you get is 128 gigabytes of storage. There is no SD card, so you have to use uh, cloud storage to store everything else, to back everything up or whatever. Um, it has a Snapdragon 710 processor, same processor as in the same processor um, in the Pixel 3a XL, for an example. So it's kind of like a mid-range processor here. Uh, water repellency. It's not waterproof. It is not this voice, this razor is not waterproof, right? So don't submerge your razor in water. It says don't let spill splashes are a little so I get in the way whether you're going for a run or taking a call in the rain. A water repellent coating, a water repellent design keeps razor protected inside and out. Motor experiences that's also on this run as well. Make it easier and faster to use a smartphone. Moto display gives you a quick preview of notifications and updates so you don't have to unlock your phone to see what's going on. Moto actions let you use simple gestures to make everything to to make everyday interactions more convenient. Just a glimpse of what your phone can do. Look for more on the Moto app. I uh, said so you who had to chop chop for the flashlight and stuff like that and you are uh, in the and if you flick your wrist the camera will open up go to storage so you'll definitely will need you definitely will need this as get unlimited high quality photo storage for free your memories are automi automatically backed up searchable and can be easily accessed shared and edited from any device so this does have uh, google photos on there you will need to use google photos because like i said there is no sd card and the good thing about google photos you can access that anywhere cluttered free android experience android as it was meant to be no duplicate apps no clunky software skins and operating system that helps you out without slowing you down. So this so this does have this does have like a stock Android experience on here. So that's pretty cool. Search for what you see with Google Lens. Google Lens is also on this one as well, so that's pretty cool. It says the smart camera with Google Lens can re recognize text. So you you can look up a dish right from the menu, add events to your calendar, get directions and Get directions, call a number, and translate words and more, or just copy and paste to save some time. Yeah. More uh, specs, uh, more specs. Like I said, it has Android uh, on her Android 9.8 Pi. Um, I heard that this one's gonna get 10 soon after release. Uh, it's gonna release with Android 9. When this phone's gonna get released with 9, but it should get Android 10 soon after its launch, so be on the lookout for that. It has 6 gigabytes of RAM, 128 GB of storage, no SD card, you have Snapdragon 710 processor, Octa-Core 2.2 GHz, your sensors for the motor razor, you have fingerprint, which is that little button in the chin, a sonometer, magnetometer, driver proximity ambient gyro proximity ambient light gps and ultrasonics battery is 25 10 milliamps holy shit so a lot smaller than i thought so this only has a 25 10 milliamp battery it's not removable of course not like the original razor where the battery was removable this one is not you have a 15 watt triple power charging so the battery is kind of small wow <laughs> kind of small for this Fun, but it is what it is. This is a affordable phone, so you do have to uh, take some uh, cuts there. Uh, display flex view. That is the main display. That is 6.2 inches affordable. It's a OLED HD 2142 by 876 pixels, 21 by 9 cinema vision. 
the that's the main display the external display which is called your quick view that is 2.7 inches OLED 600 by 800 pixels 4 by 3 x like ratio um, the main display it does have a plastic screen it's just screens plastic because it's affordable fan so the screen's plastic I said to keep it in mind the design is unfolded something to you by what's not to you by 6.9 millimeters bolted to into you by 94 by 14 millimeters out of fan weighs 205 grams water water protection flash proof with water repellent with water resistant nano cutting it is not waterproof it is not waterproof so I do keep it in mind it's a water repellent so if you guys get a little bit of water on it you're fine if you submerge the fan in water you might not be fine, alright? So don't submerge it, rest if I don't want to do not submerge it. It's available in Nor. It's available in black there, I can't pronounce that in right there. Cameras. Uh, you have a 16 megapixel rear camera with f1.7 aperture lens. You have EIS, dual pixel autofocus. There's autofocus color correlation, correlated temperature. Dual LED flash, 5 megapixel front facing camera with f2.0 aperture lens, with screen flash. Uh, there's a rear facing camera, video captures. I think I think this records in 4K. I think it does. Uh, has a uh, bottom ported speaker, four mics, no FM radio. There's your LTE uh, bands there, bands 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 13, 20, 28, and 66. Uh, eSIM, it takes the MC, it, it's an eSIM. Uh, so do you keep it in mind? So there is no SIM card, it's an eSIM. It has USB Type C, but the 5.0 NFC, Wi Fi 802.11 ABGN. AC dual band Wi Fi hotspot in the boxes. Y'all guys get the Razer phone uh, components. You get the Razer earbuds, accessories, case, turbo power charger, USB C cable, headset adapter, cable, and guides. So that's what you guys get in the uh, that's what you guys get in the box there. So this motor Razer is going to Verizon Wireless exclusively and it's going to be expensive as fuck it's going to be 1500 bucks when it is released I heard this was I heard that this one's going to get released in January 2020 to Verizon Wireless here in the United States so if you guys are on Verizon y'all guys might want to check this one out if you guys are interested uh, this one is worth checking out obviously because it will bring back old memories of the Razer phone from back in the day, I would bring back n n n nostalgia. So what this phone has is uh, what this phone has is n n n nostalgia in terms of the design of the phone. It's a all-screen phone which has nostalgia and modern uh, aspects to the phone here. So uh, so the so the nostalgia is the name of the phone and the design of the phone. Uh, the modern stuff is all screen this time. There is no keypad. It's all screen this time. Um, it's touch screen on both inside and outside displays. Uh, there is no wireless charging. The part, the back of the front is plastic there where the Motorola logo is. That's plastic. So they keep it in mind. So there you guys have it. The, Motor the Motorola Razr affordable edition has been announced by Motorola it's coming out January 2022 of Verizon Wireless for 1500 bucks so if you guys are interested in that friend check it out when it is available in January 2020 at Verizon in the states so if you guys enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up you guys are a smell a lot please rate comment subscribe thank you very much for watching my video and now I've got you guys in the next one peace out